Is a huge apocalyptic swarm of AI agents coming for your job? The answer is yes. So in this video, we are going to be talking about the advent of AI agents and how you can ensure yourself maybe uh, against this coming apocalypse of super intelligent robots that are going to be working in concert to I'll get you fired. Okay, so what are these uh, AI agents? These are different AIs that perform different functions and they work together and they actually uh, can show uh, behavior and they can act uh, on your behalf to complete your tasks. So for example, right now if you want to uh, book a hotel, you go to booking.com and then you scroll through all of these hotels for like an hour and maybe then you are going to like Pick the one that you like and you are going to fill out all of these forms and make a reservation. But right now in the near future, and it's like already actually coming and it's already actually here, uh, these uh, AI agents are going to be doing all of this stuff for you. Okay, so uh, they have different functions like web developer, um, a coder, a marketer, copywriter, and they can interact with each other to get stuff done. Uh, so then basically in uh, the coming months and years, we are going to be seeing full autonomous uh, organizations that are just made of uh, AIs. So I've been exploring this topic for quite a while. So in this video, I'm going to show you some of the coolest uh, companies that are uh, doing stuff with AI agents. I'm going to leave all of the uh, links uh, to these uh, websites in the description. So let's just get started. You can also just like this video, subscribe to my channel. I don't care. Okay, first thing, uh, very soon you are going to be interacting with AI powered 3D volumetric holograms. So 3D humans from a single 2D photo. Okay, so when you are going to be entering a store or something, instead of a cashier or a sales assistant, you will be just talking to a perfectly trained AI agent. Okay, so that's like the, mm, the first uh, thing that uh, really caught my eye. This is going to be actually pretty awesome, but that's just like the beginning. The next thing that is actually going to displace loads of uh, people and get people fired and improve uh, productivity of companies vastly is uh, the agent force from Salesforce. So humans with agents drive customer success together, build and customize autonomous AI agents to support your employees and customers 24 seven. So this has been recently uh, announced by uh, Salesforce. And of course they are putting like human first, but pretty soon you'll be able to like fire half of your sales force. Uh, so then you can just replace it with uh, agent force, save a lot of money, you know, make more profit. Uh, fire some people, less HR overhead, this is perfect. Okay, so uh, this is absolutely uh, mind-blowing. You can see like what is agent force, uh, how does it work, but basically uh, an agent force agent is a proactive autonomous application that provides specialized always-on support to employees or customers. They're equipped with the necessary business knowledge to execute tasks according to their specific role. So the whole thing about this is that uh, you can just feed uh, all of your database into this kind of uh, service agent or sales agent, sales development representative, sales coach, and they will have all of this information, personal shopper agent, uh, campaign agent, uh, and you know, not only uh, they will be hot, but they will also give you personalized um, advice on how to um, do a better job as a salesperson. Uh, you can, you know, you can choose from all of these uh, different um, AI agents uh, and uh, you have like an agent uh, builder here. So uh, this is uh, going to be uh, pretty cool. Basically they can uh, have like different workflows, send emails, answer questions, book meetings, hand off uh, to um, seller. Mm, it's going to be actually pretty amazing because 
they will do half of your just the, the menial job of sales for you. So then you can actually focus on uh, stuff that matters. The whole pricing structure here uh, has changed because of this agent force. Uh, Salesforce is betting really big on uh, this thing, so much so that uh, Salesforce uh, that actually owns Slack also brings agents uh, purpose-built AI and CRM data into one work operating system to fuel productivity. Okay, so uh, here, hi, I'm your agent built on uh, Salesforce trust layer. So now when you have uh, Slack and you start just interacting with uh, your Slack, you can also talk to these agents. Uh, you can build different uh, workflows, you can ask about everything, uh, retrieve information, but this uh, agent can also take action on your behalf, uh, which is actually pretty awesome. But the main thing that actually like really blew my mind when it comes to these AI agents is that you probably won't be using just something like um, OpenAI or uh, Google Gemini to get all of this agent stuff done, uh, there are other companies uh, that are kind of taking all of the best stuff from these big companies and using all of their models like Llama or Claude or uh, Gemini or uh, Google, whatever. Uh, and they are hooking up their systems into um, APIs of these uh, big models so that they can uh, because of these uh, call functions and API integrations, they are able uh, to build these autonomous agents that can take action on your behalf and connect all of your apps. Uh, so this is going to be just such a game changer. It's like Zapier or Make, but actually, uh, you know, it's uh, going to be all automatic. You won't have to be doing all of these things. Uh, these apps will be just connected automatically. So for example, here, API DNA. Uh, so autonomous AI agents uh, take the complexity um, out of API integrations and empower developers with an easy, seamless, safe, and secure automated AI platform experience. Okay, so we don't use AI to see. Um, to tell you what is the best uh, day to wear. No, can't read this stuff fast enough, but okay. But the way it works is that um, it transforms the way you connect your uh, software systems using the advanced capabilities of the autonomous AI agents. So then you rapidly integrate all of your apps. Uh, you um, do client mapping, API response management, and more data handling, instant code generations. Uh, it will actually, it has this recursive learning function uh, so that if it makes a mistake, it's going to just come back and actually just fix uh, the stuff uh, for you. Uh, so this is pretty amazing. Uh, and it will just give you the like um, ready-made solution that has been like thought out way better than actually if a uh, human uh, did it, like most humans, like me, for example, uh, I would never do this stuff. Then you have like real-time monitoring, dynamic scalability, a versatile connectivity, and all of this uh, regular corporate jargon. But the um, idea is that you connect various uh, APIs uh, and um, uh, you deploy these agents so they do a lot of stuff on your behalf. Next, we have something like Crew AI, the leading multi-agent platform. It allows you to streamline workflows across the industries with powerful AI agents, uh, build and deploy automated workflows using any LLM and cloud platform. So you just, again, grab any LLM uh, and you have these crews of uh, agents that are just running around and doing stuff for you. And the best thing is that these are like completely no code solutions. So you don't even need to uh, know how to code at all. Uh, you can just completely uh, do it with this kind of simple uh, interface, uh, create a whole bunch of, uh, for example, uh, lead enrichment crew, customer support crew, project planning crew, sales email sender crew, marketing ideas crew, blog generation crew, right? Then you can also track in all of uh, your crews and uh, make sure that uh, you have uh, proper inputs uh, for these agents so they can actually do uh, the job properly. 
Uh, another cool thing is Workato. So we have Workato co-pilots. Uh, so Workato's natural language co-pilots let you focus on the problem to solve rather than building automations. Uh, build or modify recipes by just describing what you like to do in plain English, develop application connector code from scratch, build confidently with AI-powered recommendations at every step. So then, um, once again, you can just harness the power of all of these uh, different models uh, and then uh, start deploying your uh, AI agents uh, f like really fast. So the really important thing is to just think about uh, all of these different use cases, you know, just think about the, all of the stuff that you are doing in your business uh, and then uh, think about how AI agents could actually do this job better. Oh, yeah, another one is Sierra which is for uh, customer experience. Uh, so this allows you to mm, just, uh, you know, have empathetic um, support, sophisticated problem solving, always on 24 seven. So this allows you to transform your customer experience to like, make it better to deploy all of these AI agents to solve all of your customers' problems. Uh, this is uh, actually a really cool marketing trend uh, where uh, we are going to be seeing more and more of these uh, AI agents just talking to us and solving our problems instead of dealing with a human. And it's actually going to work. Then we have multi-on AI agents that act on your behalf. Uh, so this is like an agent API, build and embed AI agents that get things done for your users by completing tasks on the web. Mm, so again, here you can build full workflows and you can deploy these AI agents to do stuff for you, just depending on your needs. For example, find the latest tweet from Elon Musk, uh, what's the top post from Hacker News, uh, all of these uh, questions and it will actually access the web, gather this information, and then mm, do uh, stuff for you. It's also really great for research. For example, uh, it will, uh, it's able to uh, just uh, access websites and gather information in real time, and then create content based on that. So this is actually pretty mind-blowing. Then we have Smith OS. Uh, so again, create uh, all of this powerful stuff, automations, bots uh, um, in minutes. Uh, and again, here you can just connect it um, to all of these different LLMs. Then in this kind of visual interface way, you can build all of these automations and uh, workflows. And um, it's uh, just going uh, to do stuff for you. Uh, again, uh, so this is like the, the same concept like uh, with uh, the other ones. You can uh, orchestrate between different apps. So forget about endless hours trying to figure out why your LLM application didn't work. Then the, the agent is basically going to design, debug and deploy uh, all of these uh, solutions uh, with ease. And you can see that this is already like big. Uh, many uh, companies are using this so this is probably for bigger companies, but uh, still, uh, this is going to be a huge game changer. And all of these solutions are going to very quickly trickle down into the mainstream. Uh, so just even small businesses uh, are going to be able to use it. Another one that I have found fascinating is Mystic AI. Uh, it allows you to run any AI model in your cloud or in their cloud. You can deploy ML in your own Azure, AWS, blah, blah, blah account or deploy it in your shared uh, GPU cluster. So they use all of this uh, technical jargon. Uh, but again, uh, this is the same idea, connecting different apps uh, to um, via API and just webhooks uh, to create swarms of uh, agents that are going to be uh, performing all of these tasks for you. Uh, designing websites, writing copy, uh, creating videos, um, interacting with each other, uh, having all of these um, hierarchies of who's doing what, and then uh, getting feedback and so on and so forth. Uh, then we have agency. 
Uh, so again, <laughs> AI agents suck. We're fixing that. Uh, from the team behind Agent Ops, I was listening to a podcast with uh, the founder of uh, this company. Uh, they are building something incredible here. It allows you to just connect all of these apps. You have like tools, co-pilots, agents. You can just dive into this thing and uh, just connect everything. Another one is um, cognition, but you know, this is not really about agents here, but just about development. So here is like honorable mentions. Uh, but still, they are building collaborative AI teammates to help ambitious engineering teams um, achieve more. Uh, stuff up is your uh, AI team faster and maybe smarter than humans. So this is like a whole crew of AI agents uh, that you can deploy. It's like having your own uh, company uh, of, for example, Amy's uh, assistant, Cody copywriter, that will uh, do most of your uh, job for you. So this opens up many possibilities. Uh, for example, to mm, just build a company on your own, you'll be the only human, but you have this whole crew of these AI agents that are helping you out. Uh, then we have Cursor. This is not for uh, about AI agents, uh, but uh, uh, this is like the perfect coding. Hello, this is Cursor, the nicest, uh, most powerful way to all of these uh, heavy uh, hitters in Silicon Valley are actually using uh, this nowadays. And finally, we have SoftGen, build web apps without coding. So it's an AI web builder. Mm, this is uh, more rudimentary, but it actually can help you build a full website within just a couple of minutes. Uh, so it kind of works like an AI agent in uh, this regard. Uh, so as you can see, it's uh, a pretty great time to be alive right now if you actually harness all of these uh, AI agents um, because they are already at your disposal. It's just a matter of just diving in and starting experimenting with these tools. Uh, so if you want to learn about uh, more uh, AI tools for digital marketing, uh, you may want to check out uh, this video over here and I'm going to see you in the next one.